All right, what is going on guys? Welcome to a brand new video. Video, as you guys can tell by the title, I'm gonna be reacting to or just like showing you guys the stupidest test answers slash funny answers from kids. And obviously, it's gonna include bad words. It's gonna be pretty funny and I hope you guys do enjoy the video. The first one we are doing is this one and it says say and write. And as you guys can see, just normal fill in the blank. Um, and this one says cow, bird, cat, dog. It says, instead of duck, it says fuck. All right, moving on. It says name, Sebastian, and then it says date, rape. I don't even know what this person was going for. How do you get rape out of a date? Like, oh my god. All right, it's about each sentence. Okay, so it says, is pen in go my a? Person unscrambled it and he put my penis in a goat. Clearly, if you look at it closely, he meant to put my pen is in a goat. But it just looks like my penis is in a goat. As which is the best estimate for the length of a football? And obviously, you can see there's choices like one foot, four feet, five feet and eight feet and this guy put one football next one it says math test and it says number one bob has 36 candy bars he eats 29 what does he have now diabetes bob has diabetes this one this one just this one just gets me every time this boy is, and you're supposed to fill in the blank, there's two answer choices, and it says sad or glad, and, you know, this girl, she basically decided to be a savage, and just put, this boy is ugly, and just made her own multiple choice blank. In one word, or in a word, describe school, and this kid put hell. Like Mrs. Edwards, my teacher. I like when she does meth with us. How can you spell math and meth? They're two different things. Can a man still reproduce with one testicle? No, girls don't find that shit attractive. When should a motorist use his or her bright bean? When he wants to be an asshole. This one and final one. I think this is the best for last. I saved this one, uh, you know, for last. And this one says, when I grow up, I want to be like mommy. And as you guys can see, that looks like a stripper pole. Those are people around her. What? Oh my God! Can notice and look a little bit closer. It actually says at the bottom, here's the message to my teacher received the next day. Dear Mrs. Jones, I wish to clarify that I'm not now, nor I have ever been an exotic dancer. I work at Home Depot and I told my daughter how hectic it was last week before the blizzard hit. I told her <laughs> we sold out every single shovel we had and then I found one more in the back room. And several people were fighting over who would get it. Her picture doesn't show me dancing around a pole. It was supposed to, to depict me selling the last snow shovel we had at Home Depot. From now on, I'll remember to check her homework more before she turns it in. You, you probably should. This is going to wrap up the video. And I want to try to upload more. As you guys know, um, we are filming a movie with my cousin and uh you know i will bring you guys along uh and there's gonna be much more videos soon um and more often because we're gonna be going to all these different places i hope you guys enjoyed the video as always please drop a like it always helps me